Joe, you're not gonna kiss her. You're not. You're not kissing. Joe, Joe. Don't watch them try and kill each other with them later. <laughs> All right, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to be watching you season three, episode five. Before we begin, I want to try a new editing style for this video. I have an idea in mind, and I think the best thing to do is just to try it, see how you guys like it, and go from there. If you guys don't like it, then no worries. I We don't have to do it ever again. It's just try it out this one time, see if it works or not, and then, yeah. But anyways, in the last episode, uh, Joe's obsessed, and it's his boss. <sighs> I don't see this going well at all. They were talking at the end of the last episode and he just started like analyzing, doing his fucking thing where he starts like analyzing you, you know, and just starts breaking you down. Like he's a fucking scout for an NFL team or something. And also they covered up Gil's murder. They connected Gil to, as the murderer to Natalie. So we covered up, we killed two birds with one stone right there. So Natalie's case is closed. They're off the hook. Pretty malicious. This season, I feel like it's just one arc after another it was joe and natalie then love killed him so they gotta cover that up then gill and now and now joe's obsessed with his boss so this is the fourth arc in this season it feels kind of weird to be honest like i don't really know if i like it that much to be honest i feel like we're not sticking to one main storyline throughout the entire season i don't know the last two seasons did and i, I kind of like that better we'll just see how the season ends so anyway i'm gonna stop wasting time we're just gonna hop right into this episode if you'd like to watch the following three actions that'll be available on patreon as well as early access to the next two videos of you will also be available on patreon and youtube membership so click the join button down below and check out the playlist of all the other early access videos i have available so anyways Let's get started. Look at you. So how do you know who those people are? You just do. I can't be thinking about you like this. No. You okay there, Joe? No. Wait, wait, wait. So Joe's gonna go after his boss, and then since Joe's gonna be pulling away from love, love's gonna fuck Theo. So that's how that's how that's gonna happen. Okay. Well, Joe has been having a little bit of a harder time making friends here. Excuse me. Do you have any friends you don't work with? Well, no. Everyone else is an asshole. For real. How's your sex life been? It's really it's great. good. Yeah, huh, not again. Oh, just... God. No. Performance issues. I'm tired anyway. Hey, we've all been there, dog. We also never rip each other's clothes off and fuck like wildcats anymore. We've been domesticated. I'm sorry about... No, no. Yeah, Joe's feelings for her are dying down again because he's obsessed with his boss. This is fine. It's normal. It's fine. And if it feels like it's not, maybe... I'm the problem. Visiting home. Theo. Yeah. Yeah, she's thinking about it. Yes, I notice Marianne in that way, but I cut it off instantly. I'm married, so she and I are just friends. Am I supposed to? All right. That's what I want in friends, to be inspired to wonder. You were just friends with love at one point, but she's not like love. They don't have any... <gasps> Joe, you're not gonna kiss her. You're not, you're not kissing. Joe, Joe. Oh shit. No, no. Yeah. Oh, okay. That felt real. That felt real. It wasn't exaggerated enough to make me think he was just in his head right there. You know, like they normally are. The problem. How do I fix it? You gotta kill love. To self destruct. Mm -hmm. He got arrested in high school. Two DUIs. Just. Mm, he's a bad boy. He's bro. He's broken. That's a little. Good kid in a tough situation, but. Love can relate, just like she related to Joe, you know? He just needs some better influences, you know? Yeah, love can fix him. He's in the driveway. Yeah, but to warn you not to put him on the street. He's on the scene. Are, are you okay? Yep. Really? Because I heard that. Yeah. Why do I feel like I walked into the middle of something? Mm. He's a kid. Kids are weird. <laughs> Cut him some slack, okay? Why are you acting so... No, no. I'm looking for trouble. You are fine. I am the problem. So why do I feel like you're hiding something? Dr. Shanja would tell me I'm falling into old patterns. No, I'm committed. Making sure there are no fraudulent charges from hotels where yeah, I know how crazy I sound. Mm. Love? Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> the way his tone of voice changed. Of NorCal? Mm hmm. Something wrong? Are you calling her out? Anything about these Uber charges in Palo Alto? Are you asking me or accusing me? I'm gonna call the credit card company to cancel. I just wanted to check in with you to make sure. Okay, sometimes Theo texts me when he's drunk and I get a... What? Nobody looks out for him. Matthew, I figure it's good to keep a line open. Joe's getting jealous. Is there something else you're not telling me? Mm. Love. Okay, he he kissed me. He kissed you? Yeah. Oh, Joe's, Joe's gotta kill him now. I mean... 
Obviously, I shut it down. Oh, that's shutting it down? Don't yell at me, please. You Let's made go. me feel like there's something wrong with me and I've done everything you asked when you've been lying to me. Mm. Oh my god, we haven't seen Psycho Joe in a minute. What the fuck was that, Joe? You are clearly not happy. I hope this weekend helps you get your shit together. I just didn't feel like a man. I was angry all the time. I came here broken. Joe? Carrie helped me embrace my inner beast. To grunt and breathe and scream. You make it sound so corny, dude. In theory, that's good advice for Joe. He needs he probably needs all that. You know, he's angry all the time. Welcome to the promised land. I got here hours ago. He looks like John Walker. Faith over fear. It's time to check out so we can check in. This is John Walker if he didn't become Captain America. You actually like these trips? In all honesty, they really have been a savior for our marriage. How? We come undone. The first time I came out here, I wept like a baby, Greg. Why would anyone want to get to that point? Don't you ever want to scream and cry and break shit? Yeah, it's a form of release, you know. Trip's about being a man. I think it's about being a kid again. Hmm. You can have a meaningful experience while maintaining a normal blood sugar level. I like this guy. It's actually realistic. <laughs> He's not on the extreme side of the scale, like uh, Sherry's husband. He makes it sound fun, actually. Sherry's husband's like too extreme. It's like, eh, it's like, it pushes you away, you know? Because, look, I've been, I've been worried about you. I, um, I heard your husband yelling it at you the other night. Bro, he wasn't like shouting at the top of his lungs. You were definitely like listening. You were like in our fucking front lawn listening to that. You had to have been. You didn't, you, there's no way you heard him from your, from your house. Like, what the, what the fuck is this? What are you doing? Animal, why are you imitating animals? I learned this mating call outside of Cartagena. Three minutes later, a doe popped out of the brush, started nuzzling my cock. <laughs> Rules! Issue with the fellow hunter. You fight it out. Yeah. yeah. No shirts! Well, no, they're gonna, Joe's gonna have to take his shirt off, and they're, they're gonna think of those chest hair super manly, huh? Oh, none of them have chest hair. You feel alive right now, don't you? And you want more. Tell me I'm wrong. He's wrong. Bro, are you trying to help him or seduce him? <laughs> oh, I thought he thought like, you know, do like a blood pack cut, just fucking cut his hand open. <laughs> Hello? He, he... Where? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He needs her. Go stop! Uh, shit like that, that's not gonna encourage Joe to keep going. It's just gonna piss him off. Boo-hoo, get up! I need him. There are no timeouts in life, Joe. Does your penis have mounds on it, you fucking pussy? No, I am not that guy. Mm, yeah, it's thinking about killing him. But... Uh, uh, take it. No. R.I.P. Squirrel. Two are related. It's about being a man, Joe! Can you please let go of the squirrel? I think you're hurting him. It's gonna snap its neck. Uh. Ah. Bro, I can't kill animals. I fucking can't. You got a problem with the fellow hunter. Bro, fuck off. You fight it out. <sighs> Joe's killing him. Joe's fucking killing him, dude. Movie. Come on, bro! Clock me, motherfucker! Fucking hit me! Ooh, ooh, oh, oh, shit. Oh, shit, you just throw him Oh, he hit his head, huh? I heard that thud. Oh, he's fucking dead! Oh, shit. Uh, okay, I thought Joe was gonna pick up, like, the, um, the knife and stab him. No, he just shoved him down there. I mean, like, dude... That is not Joe's fault at all. He was like that was an accident, if anything. No one oh, did he shove this dude down the stairs? <gasps> oh, 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 he didn't. But he wanted to, huh? Yeah. This is an emergency. I, I, I don't think he's breathing. Shoot, he's dead. We don't. We don't know that. What's going on? Bro, check his balls. We don't know that. He might not be. I feel like he's not dead. I feel like he's he's not dead, and then he's gonna be like, it's my fucking manhood that kept me alive, or some shit like that. You saving me. You're alive. What? Of course I'm alive. <laughs> oh, I've been taking glutathione for a decade. The fuck? I'm impossible to kill. <laughs> oh. 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 Fucking pop their shoulder back into place just like that. And this fucking guy. He's gonna tell him I threw him off a fucking cliff that I'm crazy, whatever. No. No, no, he's not. He's gonna be proud of you. Goldberg is a fucking animal. You are one fine specimen of a man, Joe. Let it out. Yes. Yeah, let it out, Joe. Welcome to the other side. Yes, they're silly. Yes, what happens out here is 
fucking nuts. All I know is I feel like me again. Why'd you get arrested, bro? I didn't think it would take so long. You could have killed yourself. Oh. Or someone else. All right, that might be stressful. You don't know that. I was driving a scooter. Oh, were you, hella, were you drunk? An electric scooter. Yeah, really drunk driving an electric scooter. They fucking arrested you for driving drunk on a scooter? Yeah. Bro, that's still pretty dangerous. Like, I mean, it depends how fast it, it can go. But like, still, you can still easily crash on one of those. <laughs> All right, ready? Oh, it's just like a bird or something, a lime. Okay, yeah, you, no, you're, you're not doing any damage on that. Oh! <laughs> I mean, you, you can still crash like that, but you're, nine out of ten times you're gonna be fine. I mean, dude, I've been on one electric scooter that went up to like fucking thirty miles an hour. You can do damage on that thing, so. So the the rumors about me taking a leave of absence because of natalie it was not true they're not true i i'm flocking out because i'm in love with you i can't stop thinking about you what <laughs> dude i didn't think you'd actually say something like that how i can focus when all i want is you oh my god you're a teenager chasing after a married woman i mean what's your end game they're bringing everyone back to kill thanos Ooh. See, okay, I knew this would happen. I knew it. I fucking go with it. Oh, is there something wrong with Henry? Because Dottie's going, I don't know. Did you go to the bakery for that frosting tip or Alaska? I saw that boy get out of your car. It's nothing. I'm just helping him out. You missed Henry's first steps. Damn, that's a big moment. I missed my son's first steps. It was honestly anticlimactic. I even think I really remember yours. I feel like the first words are way more important than the first steps anyway. Just Blame be... Joe all you want. The truth is, you preferred him when he was a problem to fix. You like someone to save. Yeah. It's the dynamic you have with your brother. So let me be blunt. Grow up. That boy will distract you from your son. Damn, that's some real shit right there, Dottie. Dude, Dottie's a way better character in this season than the last season. Bro, watch him be like, I nutted in you by accident. Oh, never again. F I don't know. I think Henry's a little young for hunting. These are gifts for Carrie. They're for us. His and hers. Huh. <laughs> watch them try and kill each other with them later. <laughs> hey, you smell. Yeah, I know. It's awful. Yeah, but Joe missed her. Joe's really embracing her now. But is love going to tell him what she did? Uh, I'm sorry. I didn't tell you about. You don't need to tell me everything. I trust you. Fuck, okay, okay. Um. <laughs> I can't remember a time when I didn't long for someone who totally accepted me. Oh, well, their mojo's back. The bakery, the, the, the alarm's been off for like four hours. Chris, but I'll go. I got it. Yeah? It's gonna be Theo, bro. He's gonna be there doing some shit. Was that I used primitive tools to carve out the time and space I need to go on a certain kind of hunt. Joe! <laughs> so he fucking did this. Oh, oh. oh my god. What, is he getting head right now from someone? He's mo- Oh, what? <laughs> you- Wow, he really is. Dude, why would you do it out there? Oh, he wants her to see, that's why. It comes for blood. Oh god! Better to feed it just enough to keep it in check. Keep it on a leash. No, no. Take it out for walks, but make sure it knows the rules. No, no, you lock that shit in a box, you throw it in the river, you dexter that shit, and you throw the key 10 miles the other way in the ocean too. Are you kidding me? Never leaving the library before dark. No one to hurry home to. You can trust me with this secret love. It's confusing, I'll admit, but I'm up for the challenge. Jesus Christ. Things will be different this time. Yo, that is like your 20th time fucking saying that. <laughs> All right, well, that was season three, episode five. The love and Theo, they they did it. I, I said this was gonna happen like a couple episodes ago. I, you could see it coming. <sighs> and then love immediately regretted it though because she realized it's getting in the way of Henry and Joe and everything. So she's like, we're never doing this again. But then she just caught him getting head. So I think that's only gonna make her do it again, if anything, to be honest, because 
she's gonna get jealous maybe somehow she's gonna see him more as like of a broken person so she's gonna try and fix him more like her mom literally said like you're at your happiest when you're trying to fix someone you know like that's you tried to fix 40 and you tried to fix joe now that joe is fixed spark's not really there but on at the same time though the sparks for joe aren't there either so it's like okay it works both ways you know the sparks aren't there for with either person then like you know the the other person's gonna notice it and they're gonna kind of be like oh well this sucks yeah joe okay so that trip basically did nothing well it did i guess it did a little bit for ultimately did nothing for joe because he's still gonna start stalking his boss he's just justifying it in a different way now he's like well you have to take you have to let the beast out a little bit yet they'll take it for a walk or whatever like no joe that is the worst fucking approach possible no no you have to get rid of it completely and it's like oh my god i don't know joe's never gonna learn it's not, he's never gonna learn dude so i don't know that entire trip might have just been like a setup for joe to get a fucking crossbow and for him or love to kill someone with a later I, honestly, I kind of feel like that's what it was for now. Like, they're either going to try and kill each other or one of them is going to kill someone else. I don't know. Like, Joe's going to kill Theo with it. That would be insane. But, like, I wouldn't be shocked. Or Love's going to kill his boss with it. I don't... I, I, that would be fucking... That would be insane if that happened. But, like, I don't know. But I'm going to stop wasting time. That was Season 3, Episode 5 of You. Comment down below. Just thought about this episode down below in the comments. And if you liked the video, like the video. And thanks for watching.